Are you looking for a really special project for Dad? This one I think will really spark your creativity just by taking some of the things that Dad already has that you can glue and maybe Dad's hobby or something that he just absolutely loves. This first one here is about 40 years old and this gave me the inspiration for today's project. This was done um, by Mama Aline probably about 40 years ago and it shows you the style. I mean even though in 40 years ago it wasn't the old uh, the old card but it was really cute project for Dad. It's, it's never faded in, in its enthusiasm for um, Dad's but I thought, why not make it for today's dad? How about the NASCAR dad? Just by going into dad's um, nuts and bolts and screws and all kinds of little things, you can make the coolest project. And I tell you, dad is going to love it. And it'll be a conversation piece for a long time. So let's get started and let me show you how I did it. First of all, I went online and I picked up a picture of a... Um, of a NASCAR um, pic photo and I enlarged it to the size I wanted and it didn't matter to me you know what it was or anything I just wanted the outside shape then you're going to take a pencil and you're going to just lightly uh, outline your pattern very lightly because there's going to be times that you're going to erase that line too so make sure you have a really good eraser too because you're you only want this on to begin with but as I put things on I kind of erased it to um, to have my pattern where it is. First thing I want you to do is to take the Aline's Tacky Glue, now this is the original glue, and put a tape nozzle on it because we have a couple things that we're going to do that are really thin that don't need very much glue. So I have my tape and I just wind it around like so. This gives me a really thin line to apply glue. Now if it's a little too thin then take your scissors and just cut just a tiny bit of that off because we still want. First thing I'm going to do is put right on this line my line of glue. See how that gives a really cool line? all the way here. Now I did pre-measure this chain and I've actually found this chain at the hardware store and I'm going to put that right into that glue line. The glue is going to dry completely clear. I think I want to cut that a little bit. Like so. Now we're going to start gluing the rest of our things and this time I'm using the Aline's Super Thick Tacky Glue. It's really perfect for hard to hold items. And I poured a little bit out on my tabletop and this is going to be my tires. Now on this one I'm not worried about my my actual um, line so I'm going to because I'm putting it right over there but I'll show you in just a second where you need to erase the line and just start stacking things on top of each other like so and just find I found this really cool um, piece I actually had in my studio that um, was like a little frame I thought it was great for the windows also I found this netting that was perfect for putting on the window because you know those NASCARs have that little netting at the window and then this was going to glue right there. Now if I wanted to glue something, let's see, really quick, have these things here. I have like a um, soda can top. So I don't want to see it, I don't want to see the line, but I want to glue this right here. So that's where you just simply erase your line and then glue it on. Like so. And that's all there is to it. It's so simple to do and you know you can get the whole family to put it together with you. Gathering all the things is so much fun and um, just keep putting them on until you want to stop. I'm Heidi Borchers and I think it's really cool to craft for dad.